Well, good morning, everybody. This is what I did. I started off, decided I would paint some little dots, and then I decided I was not cut out for issue art or dot art. I leave that to the master Bry and his experience. But I did do the something with that board. I painted me an ocean scene. This is what I did for the dots. No pattern to it, just simple little dots. And I might change it up, but it was interesting. Now this is what I did with that cross. I started making dots and then I decided, well, I will, let me see if I can get it all in there. I will paint me a ship with the seagulls and the sun just coming up, making everything orange. It looks like it's up there in, uh, uh, what's the name of that bay up in Washington, with all them cedar trees and, and, and pine trees and stuff. But that's what I did. Sorry to disappoint, but this was pretty. I like the dots. I guess I could put dots inside dots. But I didn't want a pattern. I just made a little simple board that I bought at Dollar Tree. And now I have a higher respect for darn art. It takes more patience, I'd say, to make a pattern out of it than it does just making some dots. Uh, I'm lucky enough to own one of Bry's paintings. And I don't think nobody's going to own this one. It's pretty low little dots. I might finish it up with something else. But that's what I made out of that bigger canvas. I thought, well, why? I'm not that good of a dart artist, but I can draw. So I made me an ocean scene, seagulls, the sun just coming up, the sky all red. What was that old saying they said? Uh, red sky in the morning, sailors take warning. That's what it says. That's what it reminds me of. But that's what I did. I'm going to have to quit slow down on painting because I ain't got a place to put all this paints, paintings. I bought me a whole bunch more canvases while I was out. So, uh, and I bought a great big one that I'm going to start. It's probably, ooh, I don't know. It's bigger than my big screen TV, so it's probably 75 inches, something like that. It's big. I don't know where I'd hang at. In the garage, probably. Because <laughs> I can't hang at the house. I already got too much stuff. But that's what I did. I, I painted that ocean scenery and uh, the, in the, signed it. I didn't sign my little bitty painting. I'm going to keep that for myself for higher respect for dot art. That's what I'm going to call that one. Have my Hudson Bay. Maybe that's what it is. Hudson Bay. That's what I'm going to call it. But, uh, I just dreamed that up out of my head. And this is what I do with, when I dream dots out of my head. Just a bunch of dots. <laughs> I have to... There's different types of artists. Now, that's what you got to respect. There is different types and different... I mean, there is portrait paintings... I can do a little bit of a portrait. There's a live uh, uh, wildlife painting. I can do. Eh, I'm not too great on wildlife. I just don't get behind. And then uh, there's birds. Now I can paint birds. I sort of like birds. And then there's a, a what I call a landscaping. I love landscapes. I love ocean sceneries. I love. Um, Always paint what you love or what you really get into, and and your painting will be beautiful. The artist has got one way of looking at something, and and, and the uh, person that admiring the artist has another way of uh, looking at his art. So, I advise everybody that's painting, enjoy what you're doing, and uh, the. 
I would say a great artist is somebody that can in, uh, admire and respect other people's art. You, it might not be their own, but they can respect other people's art and what they like to do. Me, I just like ocean scenery. If you look, you'll see uh, I like ocean more than anything. Uh, or bodies of water, the sunrise, the moonset, something out in nature. It's got light spots on there. When you look at this painting, uh, when it's hanging on the wall, I hope I can buy the frame for it, them trees really come to light. You can see them all the way down to the ground. And, uh, and the light shining through them. They don't look quite as black as it did. And my orange sun just crack it up. Burn it off the haze of the bay. Well, I better let you go. But remember, I sort of like my little dots. I don't know why I get into it or not, but I'm starting from scratch. I don't know which way to put it, though. Maybe on an angle. <laughs> that makes you sick. Look at that. Go in and out. <laughs> you guys have a great one. I wish I was on that boat sailing off this morning to some foreign place. Might get around and go and, when it cools off, go up, uh, go out and see some more countryside. Talk to you guys later. Remember, if you haven't subscribed, subscribe. Give me a thumbs up. Make a comment. And one more. Oh, hit the bell. Yeah. And I'm still working on my subscribers.